Hey guys, welcome back to my YouTube channel and today I have a very exciting video for you which is short, gives a lot of knowledge, at least that's what I think, help you how to color correct because I did a few color correcting videos on my Instagram and I've got a lot of requests to go up here on my YouTube channel and do it more in details and just talk about it so I thought why not create like a fun video for you which is short and simple and will give you one-on-one -on -one understanding about color correcting and for that I chose one of my favorite color correcting sticks pencils lipsticks that I use which is from Wow by Wuju these are picture perfect full cover correctors and I've got them in different colors and basically more in the video you will see what each color answers for and how you can use it so if you want to know how to color correct to perfection keep watching so we will start with a little bit understanding about what is color correcting and what is it being used for so there's three rules that you need to understand um, first thing is uh, why are you color correcting? Which areas are you color correcting? And what is the right shade to use for color correcting? So you need to keep in mind that there's um, main colors that uh, a lot of people use, which is like orangey pink, purple, yellow, green. So a lot also depends on your skin tone and then you will be able to understand which are the right colors to use for your color correcting, if you do need color correcting in general. Now, today I do wanna show you like a very quick kind of tutorial on how to color correct and basically to show you uh, my way of color correcting and what do I use. Today I'm using these beautiful color correctors, picture perfect, full cover correction from Wow by Wuju and there's four shades that I have right, me, uh, right here. These are the main shades that a lot of people use for color correcting and this is how they look like. They look like little lipsticks which I love I think it's very easy to use so here we have the orangey pink then we've got the purple then we've got the green and basically like a peach color so since I'm wearing green the first color corrector that I'm gonna use is green color right here as I told you green is for color uh, correcting the redness that you have so that's exactly what I'm gonna do that the red spots so there is redness and then there is red spots like dark spots so I have few dark spots right I'm gonna take a little mirror and make sure that I don't extra color correct because it's all about the less is more so I'm taking that green color corrector and I'm just gonna color right here I've got a few red dark spots in here and here as well and here and a little bit here oh and here I've got the big one so <laughs> Literally loving the texture. Oh, these are gonna blend beautifully, by the way. I could tell. I'm gonna take the peachy shade right here, which is almost looks like a concealer. And basically, what I'm gonna do is I'm just gonna put it under my eyes just to even out um, if I have like too dark of a circles. And I haven't slept these days very well. So that's gonna really fix me up. <laughs> Almost like um, my skin tone, like it doesn't even show that much, which I love. So basically it's gonna be really nice with my foundation and with the concealer that I'm gonna put on top. I'm gonna go ahead and use the purple co corrector from Wow by Wuju, uh, which is picture perfect, full cover correction. I guess already showed you how it looks like and the colors are so pretty, like literally you think it's like a purple lipstick. <laughs> but I'm gonna apply that where I have that uneven skin tones just to make sure that once I apply the foundation in all the areas of my face, my face looks like an exact same tone everywhere and that's what this color corrector is going to help me with and it's so easy to use a pencil like that because you really have control on how much product you want to put and also the areas like the small details areas so let's say for example around here around the nose i'm not sure i would really properly get with a brush but with a pencil like that you can really just 
switch the side that you're using it with and just like get in there which I really like I look weird the last one that I'm gonna use is orangey like dark orangey one and I'm just gonna also apply it around my area just to kind of make sure that my skin looks perfect it look ridiculous but trust me when you see the final result you're gonna be like what girl so you can see it blends like literally in seconds like i haven't even spent one minute under this and it's already perfectly blended which i love if you remember guys i told you that the texture really looks like that it's gonna blend really easy so i am using this beautiful contour and conceal powder from a wawa Uju, and this is contour revolution sculpting palette so you've got the highlight the contour and the sculpt i'm just gonna use a brush like that from uh wawa Uju, and this is a foundation brush in 202 but i'm gonna use it as my concealer brush and just apply it under my eye so I'm just applying it right where I was applying the peachy shade now I'm gonna take this shade right here and kind of contour my cheekbones I'm doing like a contouring and concealing before my foundation just because I feel like that sometimes it even enhances your features more Almost tip of my nose under my lip and right here use a brush which is a really cool double-sided brush like this this is also from wow by Wuju, and this is dual sculpting blush brush but I would use this side right here as to blend my contour So you can see I barely blended and it already turned into like a very nice shadow and now I'm gonna blend right here as well and once I would apply foundation it would look perfect. I use a kabuki brush like this this is also from a wow by Wuju, and this is face perfect uh, perfecting brush 203 I love this brush when I kind of use a buffing technique I love using brushes like this and this is one of my favorite brushes whenever I do buffing technique so I'm literally just gonna buff my concealer onto my under eye I'm gonna use one of my favorite translucent powders and this is also from Wow by Wuju and this is master finish matte setting powder and what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna use the same kabuki brush that I used for my concealer um, and kind of just yet again buff it onto my oily t-zones area same kabuki brush from Wow by Wuju in 203 and I'm gonna tap onto my loose translucent powder and just buff it onto my under eye just to make sure nothing gets oily and nothing moves throughout the day i'm gonna use wa by wuju again and this is another one of my favorite products that i use a lot on my videos as well this is bronze beauty satin press powder and the shade of it is like perfect for me it's in y235 sahara sand and sahara sand and that's how it looks it's like a very beautiful brownish uh bronze back to that same double brush that i've used for my creamy contour i'm just gonna take the same uh, side and just apply a very tiny bit onto my cheekbones so that's it you guys this is my easy one-on-one color correcting with a wow by wuju product and i really hope you guys enjoy the video now if you want me to do more one-on-ones do leave me comments down below and i'll see you soon